Okay, this one is um, this one is starting a report from scratch because I figured that you know you might actually be doing that. So what I've got here is um, down the bottom you can set up a new report or notice. So checked out or overdue materials is what we want that are overdue by one seven days. I don't, I'll uncheck unpaid library fines, I'll uncheck unpaid patron fines and I'm going to change that to notices. I don't want all my patron types, I want to clear all and I just want admin, faculty and senior Frogmore students, OK. You can see, so now it's starting to look like the, the one that I'd already made. I don't want to include patrons of other sites, I do want to include all, let's just say I want to include all circulation types um, and I also want to include anything that my patrons have from um, our other site. Continue. I want to um, select and sort from A to ZZZ. I want it via email. You can see this is already filled in. You'll probably have to fill it in yourself but this is set up now so that um, I can't even remember where I set that up. You can set that up so it does it automatically somewhere. Email 1 and email 2. You can see that the notice is different. Um, I customised that so that um, it said what I wanted, to, wanted it to say. Um, I'll always include the price because, geez, when you write $30 on something, you do tend to get stuff back. Barcode, grade level, homeroom, save setup. This is where you get to choose the item, so I'm going to put overdue, oh, I can't even remember what I put now, overdue notice, staff and students, one to seven days, test, so I can do, delete it later. I can do a weekly on a Monday at, doesn't matter when, 3 p.m. and save. Da, 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 da. So now because it's alphabetical um, I'm going to have to go and find it now. There it is. So overdue notice, staff and students, one to seven days test is sitting there and it will run every day, every Monday at 3 p.m. and that's just how you write, that's how you do a new one. I'm going to delete it now before it gets sent out. So, But you can see how basically you just run a new email notice from the new report or notice at the bottom here. Enjoy.